like we're on live again. All right, guys. Well, it looks like uh, Shaw's team is going to start CT and uh, Dimples. Uh, Adderall's team is going to start T. Well, there seems to be confusion from the CTs right here, but it shouldn't matter too much. The Ts are playing just as passive. And it looks like they're going to be going for a mid control on the T side with two players going underpass. But Shaw will be in the window, and it's going to be his contact that'll really matter. He should have spotted the two guys there running up connector. And this, with two players CT, this is going to be hard to hold the A site as they are pinching and managed to get that kill there. And Adderall is hunting this last frag, but managed or stopped at the last second, and they are planning for Cat. Adderall in window, taking these fights, and then pushing up the T. Beautiful play coming frag. in from the T's right here. Oh, but Dimples is managing to get some kills here. No. Oh, no, and Adderall goes down to the pistol round. That was a very crucial round for them to win. Well, the T is, they did get the plant. Let's see if they're going to force up here or are they going to like to save for the next round. The new meta, some teams actually, there really is no meta. Some people buy up, but it is smart to wait till next round because then you could have a full AK buy. They did get the bomb down, so it is smart for them to be saving, full saving here. As most likely the CTs will still have these umps from us and scout for the next round. And Shaw is fighting Adderall at middle and gets the tag. Adderall is all that's left as his team ran out a ramp. And There's actually a TK coming in from the T side right there. Nothing mattered too much. It's not like it was a round that they were supposed to win. This is a round they're supposed to win, so let's see what the T's have in store for us right now. I know Adderall is a amazing, one of the best players I know on Mirage, so let's see what he has in store for us today. Now it looks like they'll be going for the same type of strat they did on the pistol round. With Hickson holding underpass and waiting for Adderall before they start walking up. But his teammates are already out mid with Split and James. Smoking the window, flashing up Cat, and it looks like it's going to be a B-Split here with a Lurk ramp. And over on the B site, we have two players, Awkward and Zintra, with Awkward spotting it and Zintra playing Cat. And it looks like Adderall is lurking onto the B site right now, trying to find an early pick onto a pushed up player. But that's, uh, that's not gonna happen. Oh, but James managed to get a kill on the window player. And wow, they managed to make the CTs rotate off a of B, and if bombs B, they don't know that. They could have an easy B flank. He goes down, and that's a B player. He saw him, he saw him. But Adderall gets taken down by Zintra. Hickson has to come up huge. CTs are on the... Parker has to run his little feet off. And Hickson manages to get one, but the bomb it... is planted for him, if he can get there in time. No, he's stuck. But he's gonna stick it, he's gonna get it! He did not hear the DC going off, and it wasn't even playing. That is unfortunate. But he does live with his gun, so in the end, it won't make much of a difference. All right. Well, looks like Split isn't going for a buy. I wonder what they're doing there. He did have enough to buy. Oh, okay. I see. I see. That was a little smart communication coming up from the T's. Uh, looks like they sh they really want to win this round to get their foot in there. They really don't want to go down 4-0 because then they'd be reset. They really need to get their foot in the door right here. James is trying to hunt the pick on the upper window, but the upper did fall back. And it looks like the terrorists are going to be going for a B play here with a lurk mid. And it looks like it's going to be all on Adderall with the tech 9 to get the entry on the guy bench. Or Van, if Zintra decides to peek up, that could go very badly for him. Especially with that AUG 100% bullet penetration against armor opponents, it could go very messy and awkward being the trade man right there. They have to get the first kill, and it's not going to be like that. He gets a triple spray down with the AUG, and awkward picks up a fourth, leaving Split all alone at top mid, and running, and he's now going up Cat and about to be spotted for the next. And his entire. 
and this is looking rough for the T side right now because they can't seem to find their footing. Seems like Shaw's going to be going mid with the off again, and he's going to get a fight here from Adderall, but Adderall is currently holding connector as the team rushes B. And it's going to be up to Vintra to hold the fight. But gets traded off. They really want to get that trade. This is How 3v2. This is very winnable for the T side. They have really good post plant position. It is very unlikely the CTs will win. They do have kits, they do have a mod, and it goes down to a 3v1. It's all up to study here for the CT side, and it is looking very grim for him. The only way that he can win this is if he jumps out a window and he looks like he's in a... Oh! He's getting a little aggressive. He's probably just going for kills. And he does not get that, and he likes to fall back. Is he going to get pushed by James? He's expecting it. Oh, he pulls out his knife just in time. That's unfortunate. Well, that's good for the T's. Get the ball rolling right here. All they need to do is just, well, basically keep winning, huh? It, this is a, this is a very puggy T-sided map. However, if um, they can manage more rounds, the better on T-side because the CT side is kind of cruisable. It is a very. It looks like it's going to be a default A take with a jungle stairs and CT smoke. With but Dimples is playing on the ticket booth. And Dimple is playing alone. He is definitely alone. Once they smoke stairs in jungle, he is completely secluded from connector. And he's going to call that and he's going to push up before the smokes get out. Nope, he falls back. He can't do anything. The op gets him. That went out. And PR is picking up the kills. But the bad jungle smoke. Awkward picks one from CT. They do not sound too happy. Yo, yo, just settle down. Y'all got this. It looks like the teaser is spreading out in default here. Just going to be looking around the map, seeing what's going on. But it does look like it's going to end up in an A split with two players going through underpass i just tabbed out of the game i'm a fucking retard and james managed to get a great kill on a shot but missing his molly and now they're boosting into the window this is going to be a big play by james if he manages to pick up a player either in market or in and he, man and he gets caught behind but adderall manages to get a pick and it's going to come down to dimples to hold this site as PDR is already out, and Split is running out. And Dimples manages to get a kill. But I don't think he's got an Adderall there, but he does manage to get the kill on the player Firebox, and Adderall is left alone here. And a 3v1. Oh, and he dies to Dimples through a golden angle. And now the T's are going to be, it looks like they're going to be forced by an F, but they paused it first. What room are we in? Just open the door and look. What I'd really like to see from the T's here is a little more coordination in their executes as they seem to be running around just hoping th that the DMC players will run into their crosshairs and it's not really working out too well for them. But the CTs have been playing fairly well and haven't been giving the terrorists the opportunity to get the picks that they're craving for. And that's really, really tough on them. 
How you doing, Evan? You want to cast with me? No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, and the game is back on. And it looks like we're going to be seeing an AK coming out of the T, -T side here. With Adderall lurking around the underpass. And they're just sitting outside air ramp. And it looks like they're going to be doing a full smoke execute with Adderall on the lurk. They got stairs, jungle, and CT all lined up. And there they go. They're off to the right. Oh. Adderall gets a dink on underpass, but does not manage to get the kill. And his team is now running out with dimples in the back line there. With the off CT. But James runs through and gets two kills at jungle. This is definitely a winnable round for the T side as James is choosing to play. He gets the kill through the murder hole. And now they're hunting the player's CP. And they know exactly where both of them are. And Flip managed to get the kill and James gets a kill. What a great round by James with the 4K. James really stepping it up and showing his team what needs to happen. I don't know I don't know where this push talk is. He's over there, you can ask him. And it seems that there is a low buy coming out of his DPs. And but it doesn't there's the T's are set up in a default with a bomb at A and it looks like there's gonna be a D fate coming out, maybe, with two players mid, and Adderall is lurking around B seeing what's going on. But Shaw is pushed up and Split managed to find him, but that spots out the bomb. And Dimples is pushed up and Palace running in and peeking. And Hickson manages to get the kill on him. Leaving two players towards the A site and one at B. And Adderall is hunting out this player at B and gets the kill. We the last two at A and Zintra gets the kill to get traded out. And the last two is there and they know exactly where he is. And, they get, and James manages to get the last kill. Just some over-aggression from the CTs right there, really throwing that round for them. If they just sit back and play that one more passive, this could easily be a 7-2 right now. And the CTs are on an eco now, which will give the Ts a lot of room to build their confidence for these coming rounds, which they are desperately going to need. And James running straight down mid with the off with no fear. Oh, insta dink right there. That was crazy. It's killing the only guy B, but now they know that the two players are on their tail T spawn, and James is pushing the market, giving them an easy plant. Along with the t their teammate in ladder room, this is great post plants for the T side. However, Dimples has managed to get his hand on the AK, and he's going to be saving it. The rest of the CTs aren't in bad positions to get some exit frags here. If the Ts aren't careful, they could end up losing two more rifles. The Ts will be exiting towards market though. Give Shaw an opportunity, but they could just run right past him, and it looks like they're going to. Oh, and gets turned on. CT's lacking a little bit of utility on a couple of their players, and only a FAMAS on Zentra. The B site is fairly low on nades, but as is the A site. As they've used two smokes on Palace? That is odd, along with a smoke on ramp. But it looks like the T's are going to be going for a full A execute again with the stairs, jungle, and CT smoke. They have absolutely no info across the map, the CT's do, but they have a decent stack over towards this site. Dimples is in a key position for the CT's here, as if he dies instantly, Dimple's hitting a shot, but two players getting instantly traded out. Into and Sidious stuck around the jungle area with 
awkward now rotating, and he's going to be going with them through jungle, which is rather odd. But they know that one is firebox now, and the other guy ramps, but Adderall managed to hit the headshot. And now a good. Post plant positions there really sealed that round for him. It's kind of questionable trying to come up through mid like that, in my opinion. While they already have two players there, they're not hitting any angles. And the match was paused by DMC there. I'm not sure why, but they're asking for an unpause right away. So it's probably something technical that they got fixed. TTs are on a pretty much full eco here with sleeping the only one with armor. But Dimples a nice shot on mid. He goes for a second one, but Split manages to pick him up. But Dimple is running out for the trade. Manages to get Split down low and gets the kill on him. Rota 3v3 and Suddy is going to have an off with some body armor. So this round could get interesting in a second. Hits a huge shot towards the beast. But it gets traded out by Hickson. And Hickson doing crazy work on the B site right now, trying to lock this one down. And Zintra left last with an op, and the plant goes down before market door. And he spots out Hickson and gets a bit of damage on him. But it looks like Adderall will find him. And the shot by Adderall seals this round. A lot of damage dealt by the CTs there. But the money on the T side is so strong at this point, they should buy out the half easy. You can sit down, dude. And the T's are spreading out into their default once again, with Adderall going towards B, looking for the underpass push. There's no mid presence at all for the T's right here. If CT's were to get aggressive right now, it could really throw a wrench into the works for the T side at the moment. But it looks like they're just going to play passive right here. Molly's coming out A and this auto sniper doing huge work. Oh, the failed CT that let that happen. That's unfortunate. But the T's have already swarmed the B site. Adderall hitting a nice shot. And now holding market door for Shaw, who's coming in, and he gets the kill on him. And now he's waiting for another one to peek into the same angle. And he gets a leg onto him, which is a great one. And, that and the nade coming finish. out, and... Oh, wow. One HP. Wow. And last up to PDR, who is on the site. But two of the players are extremely low, and he's going to pass. Oh, that's unfortunate. What a roller coaster of a round. Starting out so bad and turning into something so good only to lose it in the end. And now we're seeing three scopes out of the CT side with two ops and one auto sniper, but two scopes out of the T side with two ops. And it looks like Dimples is going to be picking up the same angle, but it looks like we're going to see a partial A execute here with PR throwing a CT smoke. And James getting a leg onto a connector player. That's really unfortunate that he walled him there. Hmm? All right. Looks like James is going to be going for a peek here against Awkward with the AWP. But it looks like Awkward will not be taking that duel and taking an off angle here with the AWP. As James is making a sufficient distraction to keep the players off the A uh, The CT players off the A side as the T's go into it. And now we see Dimples spamming through smoke, getting kills, and PDR 
about to take this fight. Dimples. Oh, but Adderall finds him first with the off. And James and Adderall pick up the two jungle players, giving this huge advantage to the T side. And they spot out the last player and smoke him off. I mean, there's one around. Broken by coming out of the CTs. As long as the T's play this correctly, this could be an 8 7 half in their favor. And Adderall going for a miss. He spots the underpass player, giving his team his heads up. Oh, but he's not. Oh, misses a second shot. Three so shots whiffed. But his team is heading B fast. Awkward is going to get a pick there. But Split picks up his teammate. Awkward is hunting for the drag. But Hickson will manage to pick him up. And it looks like Shaw and Sooty will be running in trying to salvage the bomb site. With James and Hickson alive. And James getting picked off by the op cat. And, and that is the half.